uh, the traffic light will definitely be a savior of a lot more crashes in the near future. Five deaths so far this year and people who live and work along Highway 109 in Davidson County hope a new traffic light can help save lives in the future. It's at the intersection of NC 109 and Clarksbury Church Road right off Highway 64 and it became operational today. Fox 8's Aaliyah Sims is live there and Aaliyah, you spent the day talking to some people about this. Do they believe a traffic light can make a difference? Well, Natalie, they say only time will tell. Over the last few months, there have been five deaths here along Highway 109, including two children. And that's not counting previously dead, previous dead crashes over the last few years. Now, people working and living in this area say it may take some time to adjust to the new traffic change, but they hope it will save lives. Driving from Denton to Thomasville, it's hard to miss the more than 10 memorials along Highway 109. Each marks the spot where a life was lost in a crash. Alarming and concerning because I don't know if it could be my family members or anyone that I work with's family members. Joshua Heath has traveled the stretch of road for two decades going to work. He knows just how dangerous it can be. In the past years, I've seen multiple crashes. Um, people just pulling out, ignoring uh, left-hand turns, you know, just trying to beat the traffic. He noticed the lights at the intersection of NC 109 and Clarksbury Church Road are finally on now. Without a traffic light there, it's definitely, it has been dangerous. They've needed it for years. If it makes it safer, that would be a good thing. Michael Chatterton saw some other improvements over the last few months. The North Carolina Department of Transportation installed rumble strips on the outside lines and center lines to alert drivers who drift. But new more had to be done. But sometimes people get a little over excited and they want to drive too fast so you have to be really careful and like I say watch out for the other guy. He's ready to see the results of the improvements. Yeah if it works it's good uh, if not maybe try something better. I think this will definitely be the fix that we've been waiting for. Um, hopefully time will tell. Now, in the next hour, a fundraiser will be held by the Silver Valley Fire Department at the subway near the Skipper Seafood here in Thomasville. It's to honor a firefighter who survived a crash that claimed the life of a mother and her two kids. Now, that family will also benefit from this fundraiser. It will run tonight from 5 to 7 tonight. Live in Davidson County, Aaliyah Sims, Fox 8 News.